Okay, boys, the Champions League final is coming up soon as Real Madrid takes on Borussia Dortmund, and I thought we should make our predictions. Even though I am a true American patriot and the most American man ever, I will still perfectly predict, like I always do, who will be the champions of Europe. What the hell is Europe? I think it's a small town in Texas. No, I'm pretty sure that's the name of my new mistress, who is definitely above the age of 18. Holy fuck, what is wrong with you guys? Let's just get straight into our predictions for the Champions League final. This should be a great match. It's the final, Creepy Clinton. No shit, it's gonna be great. I hope Boca Juniors win. Sleepy Joe, how the fuck do you still not know who's playing? Before we get into our predictions, let's go over how both teams got here. Real Madrid finished atop of their group with no real challenge, then played RB Leipzig in the round of 16 and beat them in a close one. After that, they took down the defending champs, Manchester City, in the quarterfinals, and then barely beat Bayern Munich in the semis in a classic. Damn, Madrid beat some good-ass teams this year. Yeah, they definitely had a tough road to the final. Beating Man City and Bayern back-to-back -back is actually insane. As for Borussia Dortmund, they were in the most difficult group by far, but managed to also win their group. In the round of 16, they beat PSV, and in the quarterfinal took down Atletico Madrid, and in the semis, Dortmund would go on to beat PSG and Kylian Mbappe. Benita Dormer was an unexpected surprise, but shit, they deserve it. They managed to get past the group of death, which by itself is impressive. Plus, PSG and Atletico were no pushover. Dortmund are super lucky to be here right now. Everyone knows a lot of shit went right for them leading up to this final. They'll still give Madrid problems. Don't sleep. As for domestic leagues, Real Madrid easily won La Liga and has been without a doubt the best team in Spain, while Dortmund actually finished fifth in the Bundesliga. How the fuck do you finish fifth in a Farmers League but manage to reach the Champions League final? The two have nothing to do with each other. Yes, they do. Dortmund are lucky bums and will get smoked by Madrid. Looks like we're getting into our predictions. This game won't be close. We all know what's going to happen. What's going to happen? The better team will win, Sleepy Joe. Who's that? Are you fucking stupid? Real Madrid has not lost a final since 1981 and somehow always seem to find a way. Madrid is winning this. They have been and will continue to run Europe. It's not that simple, Donald. Players and personnel matter too. Are you trying to say that Dortmund has better players than Real Madrid? I'm not saying that. Exactly, so shut the fuck up. What's interesting about this final is that this is actually the Jude Bellingham derby. I've heard that this Jude Bellingham fellow is very young and very good. He's over the age of 18, which means he's too old for you, creepy Clinton. I think the proper term is bloke. Holy fuck, Sleepy Joe. Stay on topic, boys. Look, Madrid is an absolute powerhouse. I mean, their whole team is full of stars, but their real strength is their midfield. Bellingham, Cruz, Modric, Valverde, and Camavinga are just unbelievable. Don't forget about Vinicius Jr. and Rudiger. I was talking about the midfield, you dumbass, but yeah, they are studs too. Goddamn, Madrid is stacked. Even though Chuameni will probably be out, which is a huge loss for Madrid, I expect the OGs to dominate in this game, especially since this is Tony Cruz's last game for Madrid. Madrid will for sure control the tempo and pace of this match. Also, Thibaut Courtois being back is huge. What about Lunin? He's been solid and deserves to start in this game. Don't get me wrong, Lunin was playing well, but Courtois is Courtois. He ain't some bum. He's one of the best goalkeepers in the world. They need him to start. He's got the talent and experience. Donald, you fat Cheeto, you need to stop glazing Madrid so much. Yeah, they good, but Dortmund is like that this season. Dortmund ain't shit. This Dortmund team is hella underrated. Emre Chan has been unbelievable and is having a career renaissance. Sabitzer has been great. And Sancho has found his form now that he left Man U and is back with Dortmund. And don't forget, they still got the OGs, Royce and Hummels, who will for sure play a big role for them in this match. Dortmund matches up well with Madrid. Sleepy Joe clearly been hitting that hunter pack. One way or another, this game will be really tight, and more likely than not will be decided by one goal. That's only if Madrid plays down to their competition. Dortmund has more experience than Madrid in these situations. Sleepy Joe, are you fucking crazy? Real Madrid has played in 17 Champions League finals and only lost three. So that means they've only won like six or something. That's Bidenomics for you. Dortmund is winning this bitch. Sleepy Joe, you don't know ball. Let's give our final winner and score predictions now. Real Madrid is the best fucking team in Europe and will run through Borussia Dortmund. Give me Los Blancos by a score of three to one. I agree with Donnie. Madrid has more talent and more experience. They can't and won't lose this. 
Vinny Jr. will be the key for Madrid and will lead them to their 15th Champions League title. Madrid win by a score of 2-0. I've gone back and forth with this, but I'm going to go with the upset and pick Dortmund to win in a tight defensive game where they edge Madrid by a score of 1-0. The team will rally around Marco Royce and make sure they send him off into the sunset. Real Madrid finna be smoking on the Dortmund pack. Give me the young and hot Madrid team to win by a score of 2-1. to one. Plus, the broads in Madrid are fine as hell. That's facts. Borussia Dortmund will expose this overrated and fraudulent ass Madrid team. Dortmund actually builds their teams while Madrid buys them. I like Dortmund over Madrid in a high-scoring 4-2 game. Okay, so these were our predictions for the Champions League final. If you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe. And comment down below who you think will win the Champions League. Also, give us a follow on our TikTok and Instagram and be sure to check out our other prediction videos. Stay tuned for new videos every week.